I'll show you where we live. How about that? Forgive the state of this bus before you even get on it. I'm sorry. Sweet. This is Connor. Hey, hey, hey. This is Dan. Hey. What's up? They work a lot harder than we do. Shane just asked an interesting question. Do you think we spent, how much of that day do we actually spend finding out things? What kind of things? You know, like, oh, we have an interview tomorrow, or oh, a box is coming, or oh, we're going to do this tour. Very, very little. Oh, you're very little. See, I said very, very often. Oh, yeah, I'm in a lot. <laughs> That's all I do. It's my job. Um, are the guys up yet? Jeff's up. He went inside. Are you going to wake up Alex? Wake up Alex. I should wake up Alex. You should. <laughs> and Darren. Alex would love it. <laughs> First of all, we, we actually share this bus with the Hush Sound, which is the first time we've ever shared a bus with any band before. Um, have they ever shared a bus before? No? Okay. So. so it's the first time for both of us, which could, was a little nerve-wracking when we first all got on there. You're not sure if you're going to get along. Conveniently, uh, everyone's been getting along uh, gloriously, I would say. And uh, just playing songs every night and, and partying and, and a lot of, lot of Halo 3 in the back. Um, so yeah, it's it's a really good vibe on this bus. It's a little dirty, it's a little cramped, but we, we get along great, so it's awesome. Um, we even have stained glass windows, as you can see, which most of the other buses don't have. Here he is, there's sunshine. <laughs> good morning. Good afternoon. Here, I'm gonna cheer him up. Really and in good case you don't see you, good evening. Good night. We are confirming a festival on July 20th in Japan today. My pants are undone. How does that feel? Feeling great. Okay, good. I wasn't kidding. Hi. I don't know where I am. Uh, Cleveland. Hello, Cleveland. <laughs> Finding out things. Yep. There's another one. Oh. Uh, well, what have I missed today so far? Uh, we've only been going for about 20 minutes. I took a shower. I was, I was explaining the, you know, the sort of average things we go through, and one of the questions was how many. How many times a day do you find out something on tour? And I said, well, pretty much 80% of the day is finding yeah, out. Yeah, at every, at every turn, yeah. in every nook, in every cranny. Yeah, like the next one I'm probably going to ask is, what's for lunch today? Who's what? What's going to be for lunch today? That's what the, the next thing I'll be finding out. Probably, I, if I had to guess, I'd say like fajitas, some veggies, a salad. I would like a fajita. A veggie fajita. Mm -hmm. um, we could show you various things that have been stapled to the wall over time. Yeah. Because when you first get on these things, they're pretty drab and boring. So, like for example, those five, are those EKG pads. Is that what they're called? Yeah. That was from when Alex went to the hospital and. Alex has a heart problem. Yes. And <laughs> what better to do with EKG pads than stick them on the wall? Yeah, they really hurt when I tore them off. Yeah. Actually, yeah. Greta from the Hush Sound pulled each of them off. And I got a bit of hair here, you know? So I don't think I've laughed that hard in a while, actually. No, it was just that. like the 40-year-old virgin, but just little tiny pieces of oh, it. Oh, it is 2nd Avenue Deli. Is this from us? Or from us? For, For us. us? By you know us? what's in here? What? Something you might want. Sunglasses? And clothes. Uh, I wear those things. Whoa. Oh! This is worse than Christmas. What is that? It is clothing for Alex. Yeah. Black shoes. Shoes, white shoes. Pink shoes. Pink shoes. shoes. Cool. Quick, Raven. check out these glasses. Let's see if we got anything it's good. All right. Okay, we got, we got uh, just a case. This is Club oh Masters. God. Those are crazy. Oh, Yo. Uh, no, I like mine better. Are these too small for my face? Can I try this one? I think these. Why is my head or is so your big? Or too big for the glasses? 
idiot's your head. Those look a little bigger, but they're kind of weird. Uh, they're pretty good though. Here, you can. They're okay. They're all right. You guys, you've seen my old shoes though. Look. This is after like a couple of months of wearing shoes. I just, I'm a filthy person. So I thought if I get them kind of darker anyway, they're gonna look like this, no nice matter shoe. what. But uh, I think it's gonna be a hard color to pull off. It's gonna look like I'm trout fishing every time I step.